Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a great day. Or, again, whenever I post this, I feel like I always say that. Um, today I am filming, as you can tell by the title, 25 quick, easy gift ideas because obviously the holidays are right around the corner. So I definitely want to share with you some really cute ideas that I thought of or looked up on Pinterest or just have heard about or anything like that. So if you guys are in desperate need for some easy and quick, they are not expensive, but you could definitely like make them expensive. I'll get into it with what I mean by that, but um, just keep watching. Don't forget to subscribe. If you enjoyed it, make sure to give it a thumbs up and let's get started. And I have reindeer ears on because it's almost Christmas. Duh. So number one I thought of were cozy blankets. Who doesn't love a soft blanket, especially in the winter time? I love getting soft blankets. If I could recommend anything, I would go for a neutral color, so either like a beige, a white, a tan, a black, or a gray, because it's most likely going to go with something in their house. Unless they like a crazy specific color that you know they only like, um, I would definitely recommend doing something more on the neutral side. But you can get these at Target, Walgreens, I'm sure like Walmart, I don't know, the different places, but I'm sure you can get these anywhere, Amazon, online. I mean, obviously I suggest going in so you can feel the blanket, like to a store, so I know Target has really soft blankets. Obviously you can get for a good price, or as I was saying in the intro, if you guys want to splurge on a really expensive soft blanket for someone, you can. So like these types of gifts, you can really just decide how much you want to spend because they go for all prices, but Target, I suggest. Number two is coffee mugs. Who doesn't love coffee mugs? I even love coffee mugs and I don't drink coffee. Um, so again, Target has such cute coffee mugs, but really any coffee mugs are adorable. Number three are sunglasses. Again, this is where you can either go super cheap or splurge. Um, I recommend like a medium good price is Key Australia. Number four, candles. So here's where you can go for a really nice candle, which would be expensive, or you can do like Bad Bath & Beyond, which has really, really yummy smelling candles, which aren't that expensive. Number five is my favorite, and I definitely don't have enough, um, fuzzy socks. Well, that's not true. I have a bunch in my beauty room, so nobody ruins my carpet, even though I spilled 100 things on it already, but I love fuzzy socks. They are so comfy, they keep your feet warm, and they're just really cozy and cute. Number six, going along with comfort. Slippers. I love slippers. You can get these literally from anywhere. Victoria's Secret has cute ones. Forever 21 has really cute ones. Um, or Uggs. I love Uggs. Ugg boots, Ugg slippers, all of them. So cute. Number seven is Lush products. I love Lush products. They have the best bath bombs and body scrubs and facial scrubs and you can basically, and moisturizers, you can basically find anything good at Lush. Number eight. Have you guys seen the Sephora gift boxes? Because they're incredible. They're not super, super cheap, but they're not, exp like, they are worth so much, and then they're such a good price. Number nine is workout attire, so like a sports bra and pants. I recommend doing, like, I think it'd be really cute to do, like, a matching sports bra and leggings set, like, workout pants set. Number 10 is a gift card of any sort, so if you don't know what to get anyone, you could literally just get them an American Express or Amex, like, gift card for however much you want to put on it. Starbucks, Sephora. Number 11 is a phone case and, like, a phone speaker. Everybody loves a speaker. If somebody doesn't have a speaker, I think it's a really good gift. Not all speakers are super expensive and nobody wants to listen to blasting music off their phone. Number 12 is jewelry. So jewelry does not have to be expensive. I know so many places where you can like customize necklaces for an initial that are literally like $10. Number 13 is perfect if you're in the cold, it's perfect for this season. It's a beanie and a scarf or like little mittens or whatever you have in mind. Um, I love beanies. I love ones that kind of like slouch off your head a little bit. Number 14 is a Polaroid camera. Everybody loves a Polaroid camera, so why not? 15 is Victoria's Secret Pajamas. They have really cute matching PJs. Um, I think they're like medium price, so it's not like you're splurging so, so much, but you're not like going super cheap either. It's kind of perfect for like a best friend, I feel like. Number 16 is a fuzzy bathrobe. I got the most comfortable fuzzy bathrobe from Rite Aid one time, so there you go. They can be really cheap and comfortable. I still have mine, I'm obsessed. 17 is a swimsuit. 
I thought of this because during this time swimsuits are a little bit more affordable since it's not like summer and hyped up yet so I thought it'd be a really cute idea to like you know get a swimsuit <laughs> number 18 something that's really in right now I guess are like mini backpacks as purses and stuff and Brandy Melville has so many different options so I definitely think you could find one from like Forever 21 or Brandy Melville and I think it's just like a really cute gift idea number 19 is like a mini nail polish set this could be so cheap, but everybody loves like good nail polishes. Number 20 is a Morphe palette. These are not that expensive. They're the best quality things. If you're a boy and your girlfriend loves makeup, get her a Morphe palette. She will literally be like, wow, where'd you learn that? And you can just be like, oh, I just like, I don't know. But you, you got it from me, Loki. Number 21, you could do like a makeup brush set. 22 is a cookbook or an art book. Number 23, kitchen supplies. Kitchen supplies, they're fun, they're cute, look. <laughs> number 24 is body butters and like hand sanitizers. And number 25, my last idea for a Christmas gift to finish off this video. Something a little bit more sentimental because I do want to finish it off by saying you don't have to pay money to have a good gift. You could either do like a framed photo, a jar filled with memories. You could do like reasons why you love someone. Those are all my Christmas ideas. I hope you like my antlers. I really tried to get into the season for you guys. And I don't have an ugly Christmas sweater. So I need one. Maybe that's what I'll ask for Christmas. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, give it a thumbs up. And I will see you guys next time. Also, don't forget to subscribe. Because I'm posting every single day in December. Bye. Mwah.